Hey, welcome back to Once Upon a Game. I'm Kevin Kitchens, and in this episode we're going to unwrap, not really unbox, the Scythe modular board. It's an expansion for Scythe that gives even more variability to the gameplay by introducing uh, modular uh, board components that go on top of the board uh, to give a uh, more variable uh, resource location each game. So. Uh, my copy came in, I was able to get one of the ones directly from uh, Stonemeyer Games, and it was shipped in a, uh, uh, just a padded manila envelope, and so it did take a uh, little, little dropping in shipping, but I don't, I don't know if that's going to affect anything or not. It took a, it took a bad, pretty bad ding there on the side, but if it is, I'm sure they'll They'll definitely uh, fix it up for me. So, if not, if it's if it's not a big deal, I don't want to trouble them with it. But take a look at what you're gonna get here. Yeah, it looks like it got dinged on a couple of corners. It wasn't really well padded. I don't know who actually handled their shipping. So you get a board. Uh, you get a big rule book. Now this may be in multiple languages. It is. I don't read Japanese. There it is in Japanese. So, uh, if you go to the English section, the rules are going to be. Um, it looks like two pages per language, full color, uh, full color rules. So, um, gives you instructions for how to use the automa uh, or changes to the automa for playing with the modular board as well. So, a large uh, manual. And then we get some cards here that are, um, let's just go ahead and take a look and tell you what they are directly without, without having to guess, but I can't read German, so we're going to skip over. Uh, structure bonus tiles. And so you get uh, a set of these, there's eight, and they just punch out very thick, very thick punch board. And then there are four punch board sheets. And these are what have the modular tiles that punch out, along with the starting faction base camps, I believe. And so what's gonna happen is there's spaces on the board that these are gonna go and they're double-sided. And what I understood from looking it up is uh, there's some rules as to how they go, and they all, one will always fit. So if you try to fit this one on and it won't work, just flip it over and it will work. So uh, when you get to the setup process. So you get four of those. I believe these are to mark the faction starting territories. And then you get a board. This is a replacement board. It's the size of the main board, not the expanded board. And that's what these are going to go on. You see the camp locations here match those. So those are going to be, they can rotate, randomize as well. So I'm going to try to open up this game board. Let's see if we've got room here. And it also is two sided. So, all right, so the board is now open. Uh, like I said, it is two sided. Um, and then, so we have some defined areas here. You can see where one of these tiles is going to go. So you could set up like that. And I'd have to again check the, the rules involved with that, because it looks like there's some defined spaces for sure. And then there's these open spaces that have nothing on them. All right, so there's room for four, and it came with four. So they would go here, and then the same thing on the other side seems to um, provide alternate uh, canned areas. So I guess you have to pick which side of the board you want to play with, and then uh, and distribute these. But this isn't a how to play it, this is a what's in it. And so what is in it is this large replacement board that hopefully yours won't get dinged up, but it looks like it's just the corners and it's not really that 
it doesn't affect anything, so I'm fine. You're gonna get the uh, resource bonus tiles, and you're gonna get four sheets of uh, modular tiles. So you're gonna get four of the modular tiles, and starting base location markers. You get eight of those, or I guess you'll get seven of those. One of them is a kind of a dummy, and a multi-language, full-color rule book. Um, it's not even page numbered that I can tell. It's just find your language and, and go to it. It's about two pages. It's two pages per language. So that is when it's, you're going to get in the modular board and increase your variability of scythe even more. Anyway, uh, thanks so much for watching. God bless you. Hit subscribe. Bye-bye. Oh!